guys welcome to the Mary Boozers RC channel uh, you've seen the past video of us flying these on their maiden flights but now I've really gotten used to it and we thought we wanted to come back and visit these two airplanes again now that I'm getting very comfortable flying them um, so we've got a special episode today I'm gonna fly as hard as I can and show you the abilities of these airplanes to my best abilities um, then we're going to do a formation flight between me and Kevin. It'll be a lot of fun, guys. We'll mix it all into one big episode. So uh, without further ado, let's get it out. Um, if you want to see the battery placements of these airplanes, we're flying them just like we did in the video before, all the way back on the E-Flight, right at the canopy hatch on the other one. Check out our other video on these two airplanes if you want to see that information. This is more of just a fun flight, show you what they actually can do. So let's get them out to the field. We're going to start with the uh, free wing show you how it does all right guys here we go we're gonna fly it hard free wing f-16 They're slowed down. Let's get her going into high alpha. That transition. Oh yeah. No gyro right now, guys. This is all me on the uh, free wing. Put on gyro when you do the high alpha. See how it handles. Trying to get her to slow down. The wind's in a weird direction right now. Gotta love it. Here we go, fly it hard challenge for the F-16s again. We got the E-Flight Thunderbirds here. We're gonna do the 
Thunderbird takeoff roll gear, put the thingies up. Here we go, whatever. You hear put the thingies up. Sweet. And the way this one high alpha, I don't know what it is about this airplane, guys. But it is a thing of beauty. Get another one. With a tip roll. Too sweet. Too freaking sweet. Hot pass from the side. The wing up. Woo! God, this plane's good. Man, I love this thing. The slow flight is just crazy on this airplane. Pull it in, get the high alpha. Gear coming out. We'll just hold it in there for the landing on the high alpha. <laughs> there you go, timer's in. Love this thing, guys, love it. All right, now let's get them both up in the air together, huh? <laughs> all right all right guys uh e-flight and free wing f-16 we're gonna fly them together today i think it's gonna be a whole lot of fun um kevin i'll let you get it started all right You're coming right on yep Oh, Woo! I'd call that tight formation. Yep. So we're gonna go down the runway and then do a. All up. right. <laughs> Pull it over the top. Yep.
Oh, where are you going? I was looking at yours. I'll come back. Oh, no. Oh, that was funny. I'm like going, hey, where's my airplane going? Oh. What the heck? What the heck did my controller just say to me? <laughs> oh, look at that, huh? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh man! With the with even planes, this is awesome. Down the runway. I think you've got the legs on me a little bit. Nice. That was cool. Man, this is awesome right now. I'm right at half. Let you catch up. Pulling vertical. Coming down the runway. Somewhere. I'm gonna slow mine down, come by high alpha here. Right. Ooh, where are you going? <laughs> Doing a high alpha. <laughs> oh, baby. You coming in or me? Uh, I'll come in. All right. I'm gonna pull throttle and high alpha by. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh-oh. Kevin's gone. I don't know what happened. He just died. No power. Uh-oh. That out? ain't good. Wonder what happened. Huh. Mm. I'm coming in. Uh-oh, we got a plane down. Sweet. Dang, that looks... So did you get that? I think I did. It looked like it exploded. We'll walk out there and see the damage. You know what happened? What? I hit a uh, flap set of gear, full flap, and okay. it just went nose dive. I don't know. Because I'm having nose up trim on it. But still, you couldn't come out of it? It just, I don't know. It just. Hey, ankle bone. Hmm. That's a can of feet. Well, I mean, there doesn't be a lot of parts right now. If the gear was up, it might not be bad. The nose cone and the... Oh, the battery check. Battery's over here. Oh, that's the fan. Where's the battery? I don't know. Somewhere out here. It's yellow. Oh, you want to take pictures? Oh, I'm yeah. taking a video. Oh. Well guys, this kind of concludes the episode, you know, they're both amazing airplanes. We, we have looked at it, we figured out what happened on this one. Our battery came loose, unfortunately in flight, and it unplugged the ESC as the battery slid out of the airplane, causing this one to just fly in on its own. Now, in better news, we got a couple scrapes on the bottom, a shark ate the wing, but the airplane is still in one piece to where we're gonna buy a new wing for it and you're gonna see this one flying some more. At the end of the day, I still love both of these airplanes. They are phenomenal uh, value for the money and they both fly absolutely great. For fast, uh, high speed, this one is my winner as far as how that flies. But for high alpha, this one does it even better. 
Um, you've seen them on both. This one gets at an angle of attack about here, whereas this one gets up to about here. I don't know what it is about them that makes them so much different on that, but it, I mean, they really do. They fly a little different than each other. If a guy wants one or the other, I can't tell you not to get either one of them. They're both great airplanes. Um, and we've always promised you if something crashes on the channel, we're going to show it to you. Whether it's good, bad, or ugly, we want you to always hear the truth. Um, it, it really wasn't the airplane on this one, though. We really feel that it was the battery had come loose, causing this one to fly in like that. Um, anyway, I love them both, guys. Get out there and buy one of them at least. You're going to like them, whichever one you choose. Check out the merch store. Like and subscribe. We'll see you guys next time.